Hello everybody, um, my name is Jadorlis426, um, or you can call me Ian, or, um, when I'm in Twitch chat, some streamers just call me Jador. It, it doesn't matter. Um, I'm gonna um, start a new playthrough of Pokemon Outlaw, um, exclusively for my YouTube channel. Um, I did play this before, like in October and November of 2019, um, but I really want to play it again, just because the quality on it was kind of scuffed and I fell asleep and was really tired playing the game, and I kind of just want to record it for YouTube, just because it's easier for me to record stuff for YouTube off stream. Just because, like, um, I was gonna say, just because, like, I don't have to, um, look at Twitch chat, I, I, I don't want to be rude to people to come into my chat, ask questions and stuff, but I also want to really read the dialogue and get involved in the story when it's especially, like, Pokemon ROM hacks and games like these, because, you know, I want to, these are really cool, so, I want to read the dialogue and everything, and, um, Pokemon Glaze is or is a really good Pokemon game, Pokemon ROM hack anyway. So I'm gonna start a new playthrough of this game. Um, we're gonna make sure all the options are good. Um, yes, they are. And we'll start a new game. Hello, welcome to the Tenode region. My name is Professor Willow, but most people just call me the Pokemon Professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. It's Dirt Week. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon as times as friend friendly playmates and at, as, at times as cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. That's what I do. And you are. Are you a boy or a girl? And we'll go with the girl. With my alter ego that I usually pet play in RPG games that I play by myself. And we'll go with Aubrey. Oh, you must be the Aubrey I've heard so much about, right? Alright, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon, where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. And we're in the middle of a far story. Or path. W what are you doing in a place like this? I wasn't expecting anyone to come. I'll, I'll take you back to this once and explain the best I can, okay? Don't be scared. I'll make sure you get ba you back over safely. But the trip isn't fun at all. This is the right place? This is, but how? I'll explain later. Somehow, you managed to slip from your universe to mine from here. It's a good thing you appeared so close to me or there'd be big trouble. Um, now that you've been here, there's something, there's nothing stop, to stop you from slipping through again. So be careful and, uh, I'm sorry, I have to go. I'll try to explain later. Bye. Not so used to talking so much anymore. <laughs> Needs to take frequent drinks. Um, let's look around our room. We have a TV. We can't interact with the whatever's next to the TV. We can't interact with that. It's clock, but it needs batteries to run. The time is stuck at 7.14 p.m. Okay, we can't interact with anything. Aubrey, good to see you. Up and about. Your dad and I were just about to go to the store in Shoko um, town to get a few things. 
Oh, and I almost forgot. Professor Willow called earlier and asked that you come by his lab today. You better head over right away. It's bad manners um, to leave someone waiting. I love you, and make sure you stay safe. Okay, there's a bench. I hear that scientists are making great strides in the field of parallel realities. Isn't science incredible? Uh, most regions only offer three starters, but Professor Willow lets you choose from five. Which will you pick? It's the JoJo starters. A statue of Chikorita, Cyndaquil, and Totodile. Those were the starter Pokemon offering its offering its note until Professor Willow imported many imported new ones from the nearby center region. Glenwood Town, where things begin anew. What's this house? Have you experienced the joy of cooking? I've heard that poffins are quite popular in the Sinnoh region. You should try making them sometime. Oh, poffins were popular in, um, in Kalos. He might not look it, but my husband is quite the chef. I've never tasted more delicious food than what he's cooked. Well, he is fat, so... She's just star staring at a tree. I've heard that some Pokemon live in trees and can only be knocked out of them with a special attack. Hello, you seem like an aspiring Pokemon trainer, am I right? Um, although, I haven't picked see you pick your starter Pokemon yet. Would you like me to show you the, po the starter Pokemon you can choose? This is Turtwig. It's just showing us... Sinnoh Pokemon, Shinx, and Relo. Oh. Our, daughter, our daughter spends most of her time in front of the TV. That might not worry some, but she watches many documentaries. She's, she's very knowledgeable about Pokemon. That's cool. If your Pokemon are feeling weak, I hear Professor Willow has a healing machine in his lap. Wrong way. Hey, look, the beach. We'll just spend all our time here. If you squint really hard, you can see across the channel, all the way to North Coast Town. Let's get our Pokemon. I'm trying to see if there's a way to make more Pokemon portable healing machine for traveling trainers to too far from Pokemon Center. So far, the work's pretty slow. Ah, you made it. I was getting worried you wanted to show up. I believe you just got your trainer's license yesterday, so I'm here to give you your very own Pokemon companion. This machine has five Pokeballs in it. Pick whichever you want. Make sure you choose carefully. This will be your new best friend after all. Chimchar. Sure. We're gonna name our Chimchar after Carlos from Resident Evil 3 and Resident Evil 3 Remake. Ah, you picked Chimchar. I always had a special fondness for Chimchar. I'd usually give you a Pokedex, but I just gave my last one out a few days ago and I haven't received any more. I have a friend called the Inventor who lives in Choco Town. I believe he has a spare Pokedex or two. Would you mind seeing him? If your Pokemon are feeling weak, feel free to talk to the aid near the, f the near the healing machine. Um, safe travels, Aubrey. Excuse me, young lady. It seems there's a quite. It seems there's quite a ruckus down the, this route. My eyes weren't what they, what they were, what they once was. Um weren't what they once was, unfortunately, so I can't really tell for sure, excuse me, but I thought I should give you a heads up. Forest pass. Go on, shoo, let us pass. Pika, Pika. Hey, Pikachu, quit harassing my parents and let them through. Pika, Pika. The Pikachu attacked. Carlos. 
this. Oh, I only need a scratch. I'm gonna get fucking paralyzed. Oh, wow. Good job. Oh, cool. Pika! Pikachu! Aubrey, that was fantastic! You're an amazing battler! I had a feeling Professor Willow would be giving you a Pokémon, so me and your father got you some presents for your journey. Here you go, this is my gift. We got the running shoes, they fit like a glove. That was the best pair of running shoes I could find. I hope you like them. If you want to run, just hold down the B button. They're great for speedy travel. Your dad has a gift for you as well. I'm not that good at getting gifts, but I thought you could use one of these. It's very useful. I well, we got the experience share. I also got new batteries for your clock. Do you have the time? It is 5.46 Eastern time, so. I think, yeah, that's 11 a.m. So that is 10. Alright, thanks Aubrey. We better head on home now before that crazy Pikachu comes back. Listen, now that you have your own Pokemon, why not challenge the gym leaders of Tanode? Just a thought, but having a goal while traveling makes the journey much more exciting. If I remember correctly, there's a gym in Ocean View City. Safe travels. Unfortunately, we need to battle as many Pokemon early on. Sandshrew is going to be a pain in the ass, is it? Isn't it, I should say. Cool. Honestly, we should just go, um... Heal again. I know, it's a pain in the ass. That's how Pokemon games like this are early on. They don't really... I mean, this Pokemon game is pretty difficult compared to a vanilla Pokemon game. Luckily, I have quick save. I can quick save anytime I want. Coming through! Hey, you there. I heard that there was a Pikachu around here. Have you seen it? Yeah, it just scared it off. What? Ugh. In that case, who are you? My name's Aubrey. Well, my name's Percy. And this is my partner, Cyndaquil. Since we missed that Pikachu, how about we battle instead? What do you say, Cyndaquil? Quill, Cyndaquil. We're both fired up. Let's battle. Good thing I healed. Oh, cool. That was good. Good job, Carlos. And we got 69 experience points. The best amount. And we learned Ember. Holy smokes! Yowzers, you're tough. You're, you'll definitely be a worthy rival for me. Since that Pikachu's gone, I'll head to Ocean View City. See you around, Aubrey. Now we got Ember, so things will be a little bit easier.
Oh, I used the wrong move. Have I gone up here before? I just turned the um, animations off just because it's faster. Especially when we have to grind a lot. Oh yeah. This is just back the other way. Twenty-five experience points is not a lot, honestly. It's a century. Useless crit. It's a Rattata, we have to kill it. Even though we get no experience, Rattatas are annoying as fuck. We have to save Tenode from Rattata. Another useless crit, oh my god. I've only been playing for like 10 minutes and I've already gotten like, um, two useless crits. Welcome to Choco Town. Oh, thanks. What a friendly guy. Uh, Choco Town is a great place for the elder, elder, elderly to relax and enjoy life. It's so calm here. Pokemon centers are a great place to rest, but if you're out in the field, you can always save the game by opening the menu. Elderly. Many trainers wonder where the Pokemon are, is. Our, two, our town is too small for one, so we just have the local general store in the middle of the town. Local generals. Is this the local gen general store? No. My uncle is a great judge of Pokemon's happiness. He might even give you an H a TM. Happiness and sadness. Without one, there can't be the other. Same with Pokemon, of course. Your Pokemon it seems neither happy nor sad. It's just something else. He probably gives return or frustration. Which, in a Pokemon Outlaw, they said, Oh, nobody knows how that works. Yeah, if your Pokemon's happy, your return is stronger. And if your Pokemon um, dislikes you, then, you know... Um, then frustration is stronger. It's pretty common sense. Inventor's house. Where's the general store? This is not the general store. Since I retired, I have nothing better to do than watch soap operas all day. Oh, to be young. I was promised 500 um, poke dollars if I watch Grandpa today, but all these soap operas are making me bored. I think this is a, this statue of Mew is incredible. Did you know that Mew is believed to have been the first Pokemon? Even though Arceus, um, Arceus, um, created the world. Um, car General Store, Candy and more. Oh, cool, Candy. I've never been in here before, I don't think. Okay, potions. Oh, they have a peep. They sell PP up? I never knew that. Uh, I need poison heal though. Or anti <laughs> antidote. And they don't have antidote. I'll, I'll take a few potions. Uh, 
50 HP, 20 HP. I'll just do the potions. I'll have to remember that then. Can't believe I played this game like so much and didn't even know they sold PP ups. This is the inventor's house. We have to go to the inventor's lab though. If I've told you once, I've told you a thousand times. Do not disturb me while while I'm working. Oh, I'm so sorry. I thought you were one of my po pestering aides. You'll be all correct. And you're an asshole. Professor Willow sent me an email a short while ago, and I have your Pokedex. Here you go. Such a shiny red color. Here, take these as well, as, as a sort of a gift to help you fill out the Pokedex entries. Uh, Aubrey, do you mind if I ask a huge, for a huge favor? There's some wonderful ruins in the milkshake swamp that I'd like to observe, but I feel much safer with an escort. Would you like coming with me? The entrance to the swamp is to the north of town. I'll be seeing you soon, I hope. Um, let's go catch a Sentrit, since Sentrit is like a really good HM slave. It can learn Surf, Cut, Strength, and it's, it's Evolve form, I think, can learn all that. Find one, and then we can quick save and quick load and catch it easily. And that's not a fucking sentry, that's a sandrew. We can just get a little bit of experience. Yep. Level 9. Taunt, a useless move. I guess we need a tallow too. Um, where's Pokeballs? We'll save right here and use. We didn't even need to use the quick save, the quick load. Oh, there's the sentry. Cool. Checking my email. No, nothing interesting this morning. Uh, bag. Try to, we'll give the experience later, EXP share later on. Um, just because Carlos needs the experience right now. The first gym is actually really difficult. So. At least we got some experience before we go into Milkshake Swamp. Aubrey, you won't believe this, but these guys won't let me get into Milkshake Swamp. Nobody enters the swamp. Go do something else instead. Still preying on innocent travelers, Team Fusion. Never thought you'd stoop so low. I've already run up. Yeah. My switch holder fell. <laughs> I use it to charge my phone. Um, I've already run off the rest of your gang in the swamp already. So you have no reason to stay here. Of course, if you have any need to protest, my Darkrai is itching for a battle. Oh, our objectives were here are complete. We'll be taking our leave now. Did those gr grunts harm you? No, thank goodness. I'm sorry, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Blake, and I'm a member of the Tenote Elite Four. I've taken it upon myself to protect travelers such as you at any expense. 
Just how, out of curiosity, why are you both going into the milkshake swamp? It's not exactly the most fun place to be. I was curious about some of the ruins in the swamp. Aubrey was going to escort me to them in case any wild Pokemon attack. I don't have any Pokemon, you see. Team Fusion, those men preventing you from entering the swamp were poking around those same ruins that allow me to escort you there myself to make sure I have frightened them all off. I'm sure Aubrey wouldn't want to be hanging around with two adults anyway. You've just begun as a trainer. Um, continue to keep striving for your dreams and rest assured they'll come true. One day, we may even battle. Come, inventor. Scientific exploration awaits. Any teleported back there. So, you don't want to step on those um, barbs. When you're exploring the milkshake swamp, make sure not to step in the poison ivy. You could seriously hamper your journey. It's shroomish. And we got a Pokeball. For the love of bug, bug types. Bug types get no love, my friend. You have to learn it. Oh, it's Adrian. Almost at level 10. Not my bugs. Hashtag, not my bug trainer. Some trainers will rematch you if you talk to them. Battling trainers over and over again can help training go by much faster. Yes, that is true. Hey, wanna have a rematch? Sure. Love bug types. He is right, like, you get more experience from battling trainers than wild Pokemon. Especially Pokemon you're super effective against. for now. It's really annoying when you fast forward and you have the sound on. I'll do it until I run out of PP. Hopefully you guys don't hear it through my mic since I'm not talking. But my TV isn't. My mic's not very good anyway, so I, I don't see why you would. I can battle them four more times.
actually six more times. I thought he had three Pokemon. I don't know why I th thought he... I don't know why I thought he had three Pokemon, but... Battle him three more times, though. last time. Okay, let me turn the sound back on. Turn the right sound back on, right? Yeah. Okay. I don't know why I would have the other sound option on that thingy. Because I'm on my emulator one. Not my, you know, capture card. I have one called um, GBA and one I have PS3. And PS3 is the only one that has the capture card um, option. Because, um, I mean, that would make sense, like, I don't use my capture card for this. I was using my other computer for a little bit, but it's just easier just to use one to record stuff like this. Carlos is evolving. Mag Punch is a really good early move. Because, um, a lot of Pokemon early on are just normal type, and fighting is the only one that's strong against, um, normal. Or super effective, I should say. Normal is, like, weak against a few Pokemon that, um, defensively, I, I should say, like, rock and steel are strong against, um, normal defensively. Swamps are home to tons of bugs. Come on, let's battle. Already double battle. Should probably just battle the trainers one on one. Whatever. Oh, 
come on. There we go. Pokebitch one came through, actually. Ugh, oh, all this mud, too. I'm just nervous. I remember someone was, um, they were like, what's the point of playing Skyrim on Novus? And I realized, like, I haven't tried to do it yet, but I might do it eventually, is go for the Platinum Trophy on PSN. I thought it was Dark Titan. Fuck me. I'm just gonna run away. Um, I beat Fallout New Vegas and got the Platinum Trophy. It's such a pain waddling, um, through the smud. Um, and those, yeah, Fallout New Vegas and stuff, you don't even have to play it on a higher difficulty. You can just play it on the easiest difficulty and get the Platinum Trophy, so I'm like, okay. Like, you get all achievements and stuff, so. Might as well just play on the easiest difficulty if you, if you can. It's hard to battle in the mud. This swamp is awesome. I could just battle that guy over and over again. And because... I need a lot of experience. If he lets me battle him over and over again, he might not even... So that would just make it the early game too easy. But... The early game is pretty hard in this game. I think it's fairy type, so I'll just do that. Okay. I'll, I mean, I'll beat him like ten times, I think. If he lets me. That defeat was crushing. You can't use running shoes in the mud. The mud's too thick. Okay. Apparently, I cannot battle again. Oh, Aubrey, you came at just the right time. As I expected, another grunt snuck back while her backs were turned. Um, look up there, by the tablet. He seems very suspicious. He must be up to no good. Do you want to see a member of the Leap 4 in action, Aubrey? Come with me, then. The inventor, it, inventor, it's best you stay here, where it's safe. I thought I ran you scum off with your tail between your legs. Ah. Uh, I snuck back here to get the information I was employed to find. They will welcome me back at headquarters like a hero. I have no time to play with games with the elite with the Pokemon League now. So long, idiots. This tablet. Are you two alright? You scared off that grunt good and proper, it seems. Wow, amazing. I'm done here for now. It's getting nasty. Thank you, Blake and Aubrey, for assisting me. Please take this. I think I got the Pokecom. It's like a cell phone. That Pokecom is advice of my own invention. It tra oh no, that's I'm thinking of the Pokenav. Um, it translates Pokemon speech into human speech and vice versa. I believe it will help you on your journey. Text translated with the Pokecom will be displayed with this color text, which is green. It'll be. I'll be going to my house now. I'll be ha much happier there, where I can work in peace. See you around, Aubrey. These ruins are amazing. Why are they here? What happened? Did I slip through the universe again? 
Oh, I thought I heard a commotion. Do you remember me? My name is Luke. I was the one who brought you back to your room last time. As I predicted, you managed to slip through again. I'm kind of in a rush, so I'll have to hold off explaining again. Would you mind helping me? I'm looking for a mud kit that wandered off. It's somewhere around here, but I can't find it anywhere. Appreciate it if you can look around for me. If you find it, I'll explain what's happening best I can. I completely forgot. Let me heal your Pokemon for you. Thank you for your help, Aubrey. Gotta find the mud kit. Stop running away. I'm running away from the feeling. The mud kit attacked. Hiding my face in the sand. I'm scared to love and lose again. I don't know if I can. I don't need the night to remind me where the lonely people go. I try running away from love, but my heart keeps telling me no. Too many people standing in the shadow. Too many people standing in the shadow of love. Aubrey, excellent work. The portal to your universe is working again, but you have to hurry before it shuts the down again. I'm sorry, but there's no time to explain. Get to the portal. And we're back in Milkshake Swamp, a place where dreams go to die. The rain makes my bugs unstoppable. Damage fire attacks, type attacks. Well, I still beat you. Um, kicked your ass. Amazing but bug type. Let's see it then. Swipes the one. Let's just let's just replace Tom for now. I think it's another. Yeah, I think it might be first swipes that you can cut the bamboo down with. But another move I can learn. So I'm not too worried. Wasn't incredible. Okay. Let's I'm gonna turn the sound again again. Down again. Let's 
sorry. Just because I get a ton of experience from this trainer. I should be in Torrent. Not Torrent. Blaze. I get all the freaking um, starter Pokemon abilities confused. So hopefully I can get Waterfall in one hit. Nope. Apparently not. Hopefully I can now. A flame Wheel, yeah. I had to, it was so annoying with the red bar sped up. Like, say what you want about me fast-forwarding, this just saves so much time. Like, if I was doing a challenge, I wouldn't, but... This is just a casual play through this game. Fucking nose protect. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Why didn't it ever use Protect before? volume again the audio I should say get out of milkshake swamp hey are you a Pokemon trainer I want to help you take this hey we got the Moo Moo milk and then she walked away what a bitch no Moo milk is delicious it restores 100 HP if you give it to your Pokemon I want that item ball but I need um cut first did you come from the milkshake swamp? I hear it's really nasty in there. The way that pond sparkles is simply beautiful. I could stare it out at it all day. Strolling in the park is very calming. Don't you feel at ease around here? My Sentry was the first Pokemon I captured. I love it more than any other Pokemon. I love spending time with my trainer. She's so friendly and it's great to come to the park every now and then. Why is the Pokemon so far away from Rest Town? Pan Pan. 
I get exhausted just walking here from my house. Pokemon Center. Hey, see those holes in the fence? You can squirm through them to get up the, um, to the old abandoned power plant. Oh, hello, I usually give advice to trainers challenging this gym, but the gym is closed right now, and the leader said he heard a commotion in the old power plant. Let's go. It's electric. I got pressured into coming in and vandalizing this old power plant. Be careful. Some of my quote-unquote friends are upstairs. I bet you think I'm pretty cool, right? Not really. I really don't think anybody is cool, to be honest. That wasn't cool. Kind of was, honestly. <laughs> What's a goodie like you doing here? Oh, I want to punch him. Carlos, he's Mac Punch. What's a tall drink of a tall um, glass of water can put a um like you could put out a fire? The, what, I forget what the exact line is. Tall glass of water like yourself could put out your fire. Could put out that fire. Oh, come on. God damn it. Arceus, damn it. Something ran by here about an hour ago. I couldn't see it, but it seemed really mad. I'm spray painting bad words on this wall. I'm such a badass. Dang. 
why the fuck did I do that? I'm gonna be paralyzed. Who are you? It's dangerous here. Just look over there. See that Pikachu? It's managed to activate the power plant's um, turbines and it seems to be absorbing electricity. You need to get out of here. You're looking for the gym leader? Well, you found him. My name is Sparky, the Ocean View City gym leader. I've been getting a lot of easy challengers recently, so I need to know how strong you are. If you manage to beat that Pikachu, I'll battle you in my gym. You'll have to figure out a way to turn off the electricity, though. Surely a tall glass of water can put out f those flames. That's what he said, I think. And for some reason, I couldn't think of it. The electricity was turned off. Oh, damn it. I should have known... It beat you to cut off the power. You who ruined my life and kicked me out of my home. I've been absorbing this electricity to level up, and now I'll teach you a lesson you'll never forget. Whenever I think about it, that when he says that, I think about um another one bites the butt dust when he's like, "You kicked me out of my home." I wonder if I wonder if that's where they got it from. Hey, we managed to level 24. I'm so freaking tired of you ruining my dreams. Believe me, I will have revenge on you. Huh, you actually did it. Well, a deal's a deal, and you upheld your end, so I'll be at my gym. Can't wait to battle you. You can beat him, you can tease him, you can treat him fair, you can leave me when he's down here. Yeah. That's definitely not the lyric. Dust, and another one gone, and another one gone, and another one bites the dust. Hey, he's gonna catch you too. Another one bites the dust. At school, you won't be popular being a goody-goody. You have to be bad. No, you don't. There's too many bad people in the world. Oh, hey! Who are you? Aubrey? That's a cute name. My name is Shell, and I just got my very first badge. Jealous? This gym was easy because I have a Pokemon that resists electric types. Wanna see? What, an electric type that looks resists its own type? At least that ain't get static. We couldn't resist your Pokemon's attacks. Drat. Aubrey got 480 for winning. I wanna check. Yeah, the audio's on. I was just making sure. You're just a rookie, so I went on easy on you. Don't expect to win again. We'll battle again soon. Don't worry.
Fixing cars is hard work. Let's have a battle instead. It's Grease Monkey Mike. And it's Shinx. And of course I lost attack. Battling you is hard work too. Whoa, when I'm working on cars, I don't pay attention to people around me. I'm Sparky's me best mechanic. I'm the, his best gym minion, too. That's a weird term. Just a sec. Jolteon, jump the car with the Thunderbolt. Jolt, Jolt. Awesome, she's up and running again. Sorry about that, Aubrey. I don't like leaving a job unfinished. You finally come to battle me, I see. Well, this battle ought to be shocking. That's where I'm officially getting. I'm deleting the game. Spectacular, electric, electrifying. You, you definitely deserve this badge. We got the jolt badge. The jolt badge lets lets you use the move HM Cut outside of battle. It also raises your Pokemon's attack by a little bit. For being such a good sport, take this too. That TM contains a wonderful move, Thunderbolt. It's a popular electric move that has a small chance of paralyzing the target. Don't forget about me, Aubrey. We'll have a rematch one day. I think I'm going to end the episode right here because I think this is a good stopping point. So. Just save the game after I heal my Pokemon. And I hope you all have a good night, good morning, good day, and I'll see you all later. See ya!